this is the poster store which is open to the public via guided tours which are bookable by looking on the website and it contains London transport posters, posters commissioned for London's transport services. There are about 7,000 different designs and there are multiple copies so we've got about 44,000 different posters in here. Well, this poster is arguably one of the most famous posters in this collection. Um, it's one of a pair um, by the surrealist artist Man Ray. Man Ray was an American artist who spent lots of time in Europe, but he only actually spent one year in London. And during that time, he was sharing a studio with another one of our famous poster artists, Edward McKnight Cowfer. This poster shows the underground roundel in space and Saturn below. Um, it was 1938 that this poster came out, so it was around the time that people were really getting quite interested in space. And this poster would have been a really kind of futuristic and exciting poster to be seen on the streets of London. So here on the table are two of my favourite posters. Over here on the left, this is a 1935 poster by Tom Eckersley and Eric Lombers. Eckersley and Lombers were students together and they were recommended to the underground by their tutor to create some posters. And this is one of the first ones that they did. This poster, the theme is by bus to the pictures tonight. And what's really cool about it is it contrasts a really kind of modern look with um, a, uh, a sweet little bus in the corner, which to us now looks quite old fashioned, but at the time would have been just as cutting edge as the poster. And then over here, we have David Booth's The Tate Gallery by Tube. And this poster is probably one of the most well-recognised posters within our collection. And what Booth did was to um, make a pun on the word tube and use a tube of paint over where the Tate Gallery would be, the stop for the Tate Gallery being Pimlico. And what he did was to practice the execution of this poster using toothpaste. 